Aloha. I'm Marsha Joyner, and I have an opinion. But as you know, I have an opinion about everything. So, yesterday, there was an election, an off-year election. So we in Hawaii only paid attention today, the day after. However, there was one election that I thought was a beacon for tomorrow. A transgender lady ran for Congress against a very bigoted man who had served 30-some years. I don't know. But he, he advertised that he was a bigot. He advertised that he didn't like the idea of a transgender woman. Can you imagine that? He came right out and said, she won. She won by big numbers. And no one thought that that could happen. I am so proud because in the era of Trump, we have gotten so that we hear all the bigoted things and the ugliness, and Trump has made it a point to talk about getting rid of the Muslims and about the poor kids that have come here, the DACA's. He has made it a point to separate us. We've already been separated. I mean, we, we've already known that. But to talk about it and to have this woman win and win big. I am so pleased with that, and I hope that that translates to our elections here in Hawaii, in this next election. Uh, yeah, we have time coming up, but we have to look and be prepared. We have to look at our candidates. We have to look at those who are bigoted, who pretend not to be, but who, every time the Christians show up, they vote with the Christians instead of what the people want. We have to begin to look at those people because they are working for us. We pay their salaries. They are working for us, and they vote with the church instead of with the people. So we have to be mindful. We have to be aware, and we have to tell them we have to take a stand against that. It's all right to be a Christian. I grew up in a convent. I am, oh, it's all right to be a Christian. But this is a democracy, and it is about the people. And so I want you to remember that. We, the people, we have to take a stand. We have to hold our legislators accountable. We have to pick out the bigots in the bunch. We need to do that. And I thank you so much for being with me each week. And I want to remind you that we are asking you to support Think Tech Hawaii. We have 50 different hosts who bring you free, the greatest cross-section of commentary of shows that you could ask for. So we're asking you to please donate. You will see the link on our webpage. Please donate. I have donated. We need you. We need you to keep us free from outside interference, free to speak our minds on all kinds of subjects. So I'm asking, please donate. Aloha.